Hey everybody, it's your girl Red African. Welcome back to my channel. Today I got you guys with a new video. I'm sorry if it looks like I have a lisp going on. I do have my retainer in. And just before I start um, with this video, I do want to give you guys a quick update and let you guys know instead of just like ignoring it or whatever. But I know I haven't posted in the last two weeks. Um, I had a close friend of mine pass away and it was the first time I've ever had someone so close to me pass away so it was my first time kind of dealing with grief and everything and death um so i just need some time off and everything just so i can collect myself um so yeah that happened and then i got into an accident which was my fault my car is okay and everything it's still kind of damaged though so there's that and then also i did start a new job i've been very very busy um with work especially starting this new job and everything um so i will do my best to post at least one video a week um i really want to aim for two but at least one especially with this new full-time job and also with my close friend passing away i just really want to go slow and not put so much stress on myself and like overwhelm myself and everything but i just wanted to give you guys a quick life update um, for those who are curious where i was or is not following me on instagram um but anyways without further ado this video is actually a new kind of video that i'm bringing onto my channel um i'm actually going to be discussing some spring fashion trends that you guys need in your wardrobe okay spring is about to start in i believe two or three weeks i wanted to show you guys some of my spring fashion trends that I'm definitely hopping on. Um, some of the trends I didn't like, but I'm showing you guys the trends that I like and some trends that I feel like you guys may like or might fit into you guys' personal style. But if you guys don't like these trends that I'm showing you that I like, there's a whole bunch of videos on YouTube. The first item that you need in your spring fashion wardrobe, a faux leather trench coat or faux leather jacket. So I got this faux leather coat from Nordstrom Rack. It's by the Mac Studio brand. I got it in a size small and this coat fits so amazing. I love it and I love how it has a belt. And faux leather and real leather has been in trend. Honestly, the fall and winter season, it's been in trend. Now the spring and summer seasons is in trend. Like I feel like leather is just a timeless, uh, fabric that would always be around and always be in especially how leather it has so much flexibility on which item you want it to be shoes pants jackets tops i just love that and you can never go wrong with the leather coat giving you that matrix kind of vibe and also since this leather uh full leather coat is not heavy it's really great for the spring um, I know spring, some areas do get a bit chilly, especially with climate change. Um, we've been getting weird seasons, okay? So lately in my area, it has been a bit cold. I know spring hasn't started, but it's, it's been kind of getting warm. But at the same time, it's been a bit chilly. I actually wore this one day and it did help. Definitely a must have. It's so sexy, yet simple. This is definitely a must have. Go and cop a leather coat. The next trending spring item you need in your closet are printed tops or if you want to call them mesh tops or see-through tops. These kind of tops have been trending. I know you guys have been seeing these tops everywhere, um, especially if you guys are familiar with the Kai. I had to cop her purple Gaia, which is in the t-shirt, I mean like a shirt form. And then I have the orange Gaia, which is in like a mini dress form. And I actually do have pictures of myself wearing this. And I'll go ahead and insert it right here so you guys can take a look. These are so amazing and definitely a great spring item, spring and summer item that you guys need in your closet. It doesn't have to be directly from Kai if your wallet can't handle it but any mesh top is definitely trendy this season um it's so sexy it just makes your body look even more like art like we all look like art but now when you're adding some mesh tops and making it like a second skin kind of thing with a printed design on it it gives it such a nice look um so i definitely am a big fan of these printed mesh tops i would love more of them honestly all right so the next trends that you guys definitely need in your closet is brown 
brown has been everywhere. All things brown, I'm talking about brown bottoms, brown tops, brown jackets, brown socks. Anything brown is definitely a must-have trend this spring and summer. Um, especially for my women of color, okay? My black girls. It looks really nice on us, guys. You really do. It really, really do. Because it's such like a nice nude. Brown has been trending. I've been seeing it everywhere. So definitely it ha it is a spring trend that I am hopping on. Um, so I recommend you all to get these brown pieces. All these pieces I actually have except this dark brown sweats are from Shein. Check out my last video. I did a sh my first Shein try on haul. So check it out to see where you the links for these items, okay? And then this brown sweatpants is actually from Misguided. Um, they're just flared, high-waisted sweatpants. And that was in my recent Misguided haul. Another trend is button-ups or cardigans. I'm not talking about the little, the large cardigans. I'm talking about like the top cardigans. I'll insert pictures as well. Those have been trending um, this spring as well. I'm not too big of a fan of that. I was before like my early college days, early high school days. And cardigans, they've been a huge trend this spring just because it's lightweight, it's cute, something to throw on. If you don't know what to wear, you could just throw on that cardigan top, um, button up top. Maybe some nice like low rise jeans. So the next trend is actually trenches or light coats. Now this one that I have here is a waterfall coat. No, I don't know if I would say it's a trench kind of coat, but I'll insert a picture of a good trench coat. They're just basically a very light version of a coat. Um, definitely great to wear in the spring, especially since spring is not always hot and it's a bit chilly. And we do have those rainy seasons as well. So definitely getting yourself a trench coat or a light coat is a necessity for the spring, especially if you're going out on date night, going out with your girls and you need something to throw on. This one I got from wearall.com. I got this like, <sighs> I got this in, when did I get this? I don't know, it's been some time, but it's not really any tag. It just says made in Italy and that's it. Um, but mine has a belt in it and it feels like this one, like I said, is a, this one feels a little heavy, but this one's a little bit warm. Um, so yeah, definitely find yourself a light trench coat. I know Misguided, I've seen Misguided have some, um, definitely on there, or even probably NAKD and definitely Zara. So definitely check those sites out if you're really interested in getting yourself a trench coat. I feel like you need that, especially if you don't have a coat to go out, okay? Like going out on dates, girls night, and I'm say proper girls night, like dinner type things, nice places, you need a trench coat. The next trend this spring is menswear. I love menswear and specifically the dress shirts, oversized dress shirts or men's dress shirts has been trendy. I've seen a lot of stores carrying like in the women's section dress shirts, like oversized dress shirts that look like it's for men. I love it so much, especially when the sleeves are flared or they have like a ruchard um ruching on the uh, sleeve with like <sighs> strings attached or whatever i love dress shirts this with some shorts or um bermuda shorts and some heels or even some nice plain white sneakers that's a look for me and a crossbody that's a look or you just wear this with like some short shorts especially if it's like a nice hot spring day um, this is really cute. I love it. It's so chic, classy. Dress shirts is definitely a trend this spring, especially the white ones. I really want to get more white dress shirts because um, it just looks so good. Just easy to throw on, especially it's like a cute casual look. And that's what I love. Cute casual. You don't have to think about it too much. Throw that on, find some nice shorts or nice pants, nice jeans or something, some cute shoes. That's it. Make sure you have your hair and makeup done. That's it, you look good. And not even just that, you could just wear some oversized sunglasses, no makeup, and you look cute with the crossbody and everything. So I recommend dress shirts. I'm definitely hopping on that wave. Y'all need to get you a dress shirt. The next spring fashion trend is pastels. How do I feel about pastels? I don't know. 
I don't know. I don't really have that much pastels in my closet. I don't even know if I even have any at all. But pastels have been trending this spring. Um, so if you're really big on like light colors and light colors look good on your skin tone, definitely reach out for some pastels this spring. You can do pastel tops, pastel bottoms, pastel shoes, like heels, sandals. That's been in. Um, I might take a look at it and see what I can what I can find. But I'm gonna throw in a picture right here and show you guys some inspo on the pastels but i know that is also on the spring fashion trends the next spring fashion trend are scarf like prints so basically it's kind of like i'm wearing a scarf on my head okay obviously um but there's been lately there's been dresses and tops that are like scarf like and prints printed like items um i'll throw in a couple pictures here to show you guys what i'm talking about but those i feel like i definitely want to get a couple of dresses like that because for the summertime especially vacation oh beautiful amazing especially since it's like scarf like it'll be very flowy and light and especially it will be great for like those warmer hotter days you don't want to wear anything that is too heavy you want it to be flowy and just you want to be able to breathe and everything like your body's just breathing and sweating freely and you know i like that especially in the summertime and especially on vacay scarf like prints is definitely a trend that i feel like everyone should hop on like that scarf feeling not even scarf but silk satin feeling it just makes you feel so expensive and so rich and i really love that so i definitely want to hop on that trend definitely going to look out for um pieces like that and hopefully i'll be able to share that with you guys so you guys can cop those same pieces that i did the next spring fashion trend are plaid prints now plaid has been in it's been in and out in and out in and out and now it's in and it's in this spring so especially plaid pants i love me a nice plaid plaid trousers high-waisted fitted with a little stretch not a little stretch with like mid stretch i love that so much because it's great for like business casual and the last one is mixing prints but mixing prints would just basically be like if you're mixing stripes with polka dots or something um you know just mixing prints mixing different things zebra with cheetah just different things like that that's been that's a spring fashion trend this spring so if you're into that kind of style that kind of vibe um when it comes to fashion this is for you mixing prints i'm gonna look closer into that and do more research and see you know if that fits in my alley or not um but these are all basically a short version of some spring fashion trends that i noticed that um grabbed my eye there was a lot more but i wanted to keep this video small since my first video doing like a spring fashion trend in depth kind of not even in depth but spring fashion trend video so just want to see if you guys like this video and if you guys do give me a thumbs up leave me a comment in the comment box below let me know if you guys want to see an accessories spring fashion trend with shoes and jewelry let me know because i'll be more than happy to do that but like i said this is not all the apparel spring fashion trends that we have this spring there's a whole bunch but i just want to show you guys some of the pieces that i like and some of the things that i may be interested in trying and i hope this give you guys some uh, good ideas on what you guys should be shopping for or looking out for this spring and summer so you guys can get ready for that since we're almost there three weeks and then it's spring and then we have a few more months until summer so i hope you guys enjoyed this video and if you have not already go ahead and hit that subscribe button all right hit hit that subscribe button make sure it turns gray and then also turn on that notification bell so you guys can stay alert to whenever i post videos all right you guys miss me i know you guys miss me i know you guys miss my videos so subscribe turn that notification bell on leave me a comment in the comment box below especially if you guys want to see more videos or a part two to this let me know in the comment box below and i'll see you guys in my next video bye